Check this out. This is an F5. The can is actually green, brewed here in Oklahoma, but I got the green screen on, <laughs> and that's pretty cool. It actually removed the green. That's really cool. Uh, so a green, uh, you can actually see through uh, the, the IPA, if that isn't cool. Well, let's go ahead and uh, get into what I'm here for. So it's just brutal outside. It is cold. It, it, we've had an extremely cold snap. And uh, so I'm just going to, I saw these chips and I haven't tried these before. And I thought it would be fun to try something a little different on the channel because I'm not cooking outside. It's currently 17 degrees and the temperature is going down. Um, and then this weekend, I'll get back into cooking. I have some videos I'll be making and one I have to make. And uh, I'm going to get those uh, when the temperature warms up. Uh, it's been below freezing for, what, 72 hours now, I would say. I don't know. It went below freezing like last Friday or Saturday and it's still there. I think tomorrow we get above freezing, things start to thaw out. And, it, and it's good because I actually had a pipe burst in this house, uh, my house today. While I was at work, I got a call. Uh, Dolores called. I can't get the water to stop. There was water pouring in the kitchen. It actually destroyed the floor. We've removed the floor. We're back to concrete. Everything's good. Uh, I got the water capped off. It was just to an outside faucet which has just been disabled till I get it repaired. And uh, yeah, it's been single digits. It's been below freezing and um, it was more than it could handle. So uh, I was at 7-Eleven and I just saw these Buffalo Cheetos. I haven't tried these and I just, I like everything Cheetos. Uh, I like the Flaming Hot Cheetos. I like the regular Cheetos. Uh, I like the extra Flaming Hot Cheetos. They had a, a Fusion one, too, I haven't tried. And I was debating on that one or this one. And, um, well, we're going to try this one. See how it tastes. Uh, I can't imagine it being bad. I've never disliked the Cheeto, really. <laughs> I just like Cheetos. So, um, just something a little different today while the weather is... Um, not cooperating with outdoor cooking. We're going to do an indoor review. So uh, just kind of take a look at this uh, package here. Nothing much out of the ordinary of a regular Cheetos package, except it does have the uh, right, right, right here. Uh, that is the uh, uh, buffalo sauce being poured in. I'm not sure how clear this is. Yeah, that's a little clear, but wow, check it out too. So part of the Cheetos bag is green and you can just see you get the Cheetos bag green you've got this green <laughs> oh, yeah that's pretty good so uh, green screen in effect on the Cheetos package and on the drink <laughs> cheers well let's go ahead and open this up And inside, just a basic uh, Cheetos. Can't really tell a whole lot of a difference on them. And I'm trying to figure out, I've, I've used this camera on some videos and sometimes it's not very clear. I think I get too close at times and there's a button you can press. I think that actually cleared it and it kind of fine tuned it a little bit. And then I can defocus or I, I don't know. Uh, but we're gonna go ahead and take one of these out. Once again, up close, let's see. If we click on this right here and I get in the mic so you can hear me and oh yeah, look at that. And then it focuses. There's the Cheeto. All right. Let's see how it tastes. I'm not sure if, the, if I should expect it to be hot, but below can be. So we'll see. Hmm. Wow. Like I said, I've never found a Cheeto I don't like. Mm. 
It's definitely not spicy, nothing like that. It has some good flavor to it. As it sets a little bit, I think it does have a minor kick, but nothing significant. Nothing like the Flaming Hot Cheetos at all. Take, take one more. Yeah. And if you like Cheetos, you're probably going to like those. Not bad. Not bad at all. Uh, so that is a look at the Crunchy Buffalo. Maybe those have been out for a while. Uh, I don't know. Let me know in the comments. Have, have those been out for a while or are those brand new? Um, I don't know. Let me let me look that up. So I did find an article and it said uh, in, I think it was August of last year, that these were coming soon. I didn't see an exact release date, so they're fairly new. Um, they very well probably came out last year and I just haven't seen them. I don't know. Uh, but I really, I will, I'll try those again. And as you said, it's one of those types of chips that the more you eat, the more heat you're going to get. Uh, nothing over the top at all. Uh, but as I was eating more and more, the heat kind of sticks and sticks. So your throat gets a little bit hotter as you keep eating. And I just am a fan of spicy foods like that. So for me, it goes well. If you don't like spicy at all, you may not like these because as you eat them, you're going to get that little bit in your throat. So that is the uh, Cheetos Crunchy of Buffalo indoor review. Uh, we'll be back outdoors cooking here in the next few days. So uh, stick around for that. I hope you enjoyed this. If you did, if you like these chips, be sure and let me know below. And just, just one more time. I just can't get over the towel. That's that green screen. That, that's just pretty cool.